Okay, so I'm going to kind of go over my food prep a little bit, so I'm just kind of rushing this right now because I have to head over to my mom's for Mother's Day. But, um, so this is just a little bit of what I've done so far. I have, um, beets, just fresh cut beets, thrown in water. I'm going to store them that way, soften them up a little bit, but putting them in water like that uh, maintains the nutrients and vitamins, um, like, versus if you, uh, boil them, um, it just kind of basically cooks out all the nutrients and vitamins, the ones that you want from this. So um, steaming, if you wanted them to do that kind of cooking them, steaming them it would be best, or roasting them, or storing them this way. I'm going to cook uh, two of these up. I have some pineapple. I'm going to be cutting up this pineapple and this uh, honeydew. <laughs> Got bananas. <laughs> um, cooked a whole bunch of quinoa here red potatoes in here. I'll be cooking up some broccoli. I've got a lot of chicken. More quinoa. <laughs> um, fresh cut corn. I just cut this off the cob and I put it in here so I can put it on salads and mix it in with other things. My avocado dressing. I have that recipe on my Instagram. I will be I'm doing a video on that. Some green beans I'll be cooking as well. And I have a bunch of stuff cooking in the oven. Sweet potatoes in the oven and some tilapia as well. So this is kind of how Sunday meal prep's going so far. I still haven't done any of my vegetables because I'm going to be doing this. I got zucchini and squash and my green beans. Tilapia! It's like lemon herb tilapia and a whole lot of sweet potatoes. Yeah. Or yams because they're the yellow. Alright, so I'm headed to my mommy's. Uh, I think my sister's in town and um, my aunt will be there. I think my grandma. I think the whole slew of us will be there. So I'm thinking I was going to stop by the store and maybe get her a flower or something. But she has like a whole garden. So <laughs> I'm like, get her a flower, but she has a whole garden. So um, I don't know, but we're going to run by the store and see if there's something that's just like cute, meaningful that I could get her because, yeah, the thought, right? <laughs> so I'm going to get some beats going first because I like some music when I ride. So I'm here, I'm going to Safeway um, and still in my gym clothes. <laughs> Went and worked out this morning with my girls and just been busting my butt all day. So we're great to be a last minute person, right? Bad, bad, I knew, but I'm sure all of us can relate with that. Ooh, there's so many. So I know she really, really loves these orchids. So maybe we'll get her one of these. These are pretty. All right. <laughs> maybe I should get her some candy. I wish I had something that was like Rocky Road, because she loves Rocky Road. We're going with the Almond Joy. Who doesn't love chocolate and coconut and almonds? This is how we do it. This is how we do it. No bags. All in one shot, right? It's not that much. So this and this beautiful thing. I think it was not cheap. <laughs> but it's so pretty. Okay. We're putting the orchid in. Baby orchid.
think it was safe for the drive. Does it look safe? <laughs> I think it was safe. I'm getting text messages. Okay, I'm here at mommy's house. It's so pretty up here. This is only part of it. Isn't that pretty? Okay, walking in. Looks like everybody's here. Okay, it's like Jurassic Park. <laughs> okay. Hello. Hi, Grammy and Papa. Hi. 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 Mama. Hi, Susie. Look at that. Did you bring that for me? That's for you. Yay. Here you go, Mama. Thank you, honey. <laughs> Oh, it's not pretty. Oh, oh. Almond Joys. <laughs> Happy Mama's Day. Thank you, honey. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look down by her feet and there's a stream of water. <laughs> Cheryl was saying if you could... Elisha! Thinking, huh? Oh, this thing for the, um, what I do, what I need there is some gluten free. Shortcake and strawberries and little clips of stuff because I clip them in with yeah, like because I do fresh yeah veggies. pretty colors huh? I do like a <laughs> here's my Jen. little sister Jen she was like, sleeping. <laughs> We need to go take video of Papa eating, licking off mm. one of those. Hi! Bucky! Bucky's getting off. She's like the bum bum bacanas. Ooh, Katie's like getting. I give my sister all my lot of gym clothes. <laughs> it pays to be a sister, right? <laughs> <sighs> Makes me work out. Mom, did you get the pink tie? Hers and hers too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? Hey. It's pretty this is my sista. I can't get enough of that cream. Ah. <laughs> whipping cream. cream. <laughs> whipping cream. <laughs> Want some of that? Whip. <laughs> Don't get it, my mouth. This is my little sister. She's just as crazy as I am. Woo! <laughs> yeah. Go in circles. Flash them all. Flash them all. <laughs> oh my Open God. it, Mama. What's, what's cooking? See? Hmm. Ooh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mama, the, the chef. Yeah, try. Thank you. Meat! <laughs> this is the best grandma in the world. <laughs> they aren't very good in the world, are they? <laughs> I like to eat around here. <laughs> Italian. We like to eat. Finally. Italian. Papa, you want to come over the table now? Mm -hmm. Buttered at corn. Don't need no butter on that corn. It's so good. What is it? <laughs> yeah. I like it. Baba, eating frenzy. <laughs> Mama's day. Yeah. Bye. You can put that up there on the counter after you film. Hi. <laughs> You did you need this honey bun? She's at the food. Must eat to grow. <laughs> the orange. You like it? Yes, I like it. <laughs> tailbone. I know. So mom put us on dessert duty. We're making dessert for mother. We're making dessert. <laughs> Your mother. Yeah. Little buns. We got honey buns, and then we little got buns. Honey buns. little buns. Little buns. Little buns. Little buns. Little buns. Big buns. <laughs> we are. This is. What is this? <laughs> Strawberry shortcake. Shortcake. Short. Horrible. Homemade. Gluten free. Horrible. Homemade and from the garden strawberries. Organic. That's how we do it. And homemade and whipped no cream. Whipped cream. <laughs> homemade whipped cream. I know. I definitely know my strawberries aren't GMO. So good. <laughs> so good. <laughs> so good. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs>
Why are you just doing that? You're putting them out. Do you want me to see? No! <laughs> <laughs> Yummy. How could you trust any of those? I am struggling. Short cake. <laughs> <laughs> I make hot cakes. I make cream cakes. How beautiful this looks. That's so what I'm beautiful. saying. My way is better. Our way. Voila. Puts the cream on <laughs> top. Being the mothers now. We're gonna bring them theirs. Well, not really. Kate's being rude. <laughs> <laughs> she's a little, she's bad. Wow. Mm, yummy. Happy yeah, Mother's Day. Mom. Thank you. Yeah, you're not done eating yet. Okay. Now we're bringing it to Jima. Did you try? Jima. Here's your strawberry shortcake. Thank you, Jan. <laughs> so I'm pretty close with my family. We lost our dad about seven years ago to a heart condition that we were unaware of. So it was a sudden death. It was pretty hard on us, but we pulled through. I think it only made us stronger and closer as a family. We just live in the moment. We enjoy every second we have with each other and just live, laugh, and love. Pretty loud, goofy, and obnoxious, and that's what makes us great is that we just don't care. So I'm really close with my sister. She's about five years younger than me. She doesn't live here, so I don't get to see her very often, but we try to make it a point to see each other when we can or send each other messages every single day. She's my bestest friend. I do have a younger brother as well. He lives in Washington. Uh, we don't see each other very often, but we do keep in touch, so we still all keep very connected. We've been through a lot as a family, but we're definitely not gonna let it get us down. We are very focused, determined people. We learn from our mistakes, we learn from experiences, and we just rise above. I believe our main purpose here is to help others, to be an example that you are strong as an individual and as a family. I believe we are also here to help others in their time of need, especially because we can all relate in some way. We're not afraid to reach out to others, and we're definitely not afraid to, as a family to talk about our problems and work through them together no matter what. I think that's important to do as a family. You are a bond that cannot be broken. Then at the mama's, I'm gonna head home now and finish the last little bit of meal prep I have and get ready for Monday. Woohoo! And then I will be going out of town for a week, going out of the country on Thursday. I'm so excited! It's gonna be tropical. Hey, you all tatted boy. <laughs> I'm playing video games. But you, I don't give a fuck. Really? <laughs> then why am I? What are you doing, Jen? That's really close. <laughs> 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 Just trying to finish up this last little meal prep so we can have food tomorrow. <laughs> you want your food? Don't mess with me. Don't mess with the buns. Don't mess with the honey buns. I'm cutting up some honeydew. This is going to be great for some breakfast. So I'm going to pit these babies, cut them up so they're all ready. Tonight's vegetable menu, we've got yellow squash with garlic and herb. Mrs. Dash. Okay, so I'm going to chop up some of my broccoli. Mm. How ironic, green for green. So this is what I'm doing with my broccoli. Look at all these green things, and yellow, and green. Honeydew, 
lots of honeydew. Okay, so now I'm going to put my meals together with everything I have pre-cooked here. You like my tower of food? <laughs> Sunday tomorrow. But I don't want to go to bed. I like to stay up late. I'm actually, if you guys didn't know, I'm a night owl. <laughs> I like to stay up. Most of the nights I stay up till probably 1 o'clock in the morning. And then I usually get up about 7 or 8. I don't know why. I've always been that way. <laughs> I usually stay up really late doing all kinds of stuff like this. Eating, watching movies, eating, meal prepping. <laughs> but we're going to get these meals prepped. Showered. And I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm just going to kind of go from there. Just wing it. Just go with it. Little tip for you guys. So I like to store my turkey with a paper towel on the bottom because all the fat from the turkey usually gathers at the bottom and then kind of sticks together and gets gross. This keeps it so it keeps your turkey separate from the fats that settle at the bottom. So paper towels are awesome to use when storing food, especially for a few days or so. So now here's a meal idea for you. We've got red potatoes, mixed red potatoes, chicken, the uh, chopped up <laughs> broccoli and cottage cheese with salsa. Mix it all together and you got yourself a yummy little meal. Super tasty. The fridge after prepping.